Good evening everyone. This is Rushali. Previously we discussed complete human computer interaction topics with lab assignments. I have mentioned complete HCI playlist link in below description box. Now in today's session we will discuss about some important points and question bank on the topics of human computer interaction. This is not a official question bank. These are the most probable question that generally asked in previous year university question papers. You must refer these questions while preparing for your exam. So let's start the session. In this channel you will get a complete point wise easy explanation, practical demo and question bank of following subjects. Please like and share these videos with your friends and subscribe the channel. So you will get the notification regarding my new coming videos. Now the first unit is introduction of HCI. On this topic they will ask the most important question is explain user centered design principle or explain why a design should be user centric. So any one question will be asked in your exam generally for six marks. Here you have to explain user centered design principles the definition with examples with diagram. The next question is explain following terms like predictability, synthesizability, familiarity and consistency or explain various principles of human computer interaction. They will ask any one question from that for 8 marks. Either you have to explain all the principles of HCI or you have to explain specific principles of HCI. The next question is what is HCI? List and explain various discipline and fields of human computer interaction for 4 marks. Here you have to mention definition of HCI and all the fields with examples. The next question is explain in detail need of study HCI for producing good interactive software for 4 marks. Here you have to explain all the needs point wise with example. The next question is there is a scenario based question. In HCI in your exam they will ask multiple scenario based question. The first scenario is this how to get to know the system user explain various methods adopted in user centered design and what are the people directly or indirectly affected by the student registration system for 8 marks. So you have to explain the scenario of student registration system as per the UCD principles. Next. The next on the topic of understanding human on this topic they will ask what is reasoning discuss with example inductive versus deductive reasoning for 4 marks. Here you have to explain definition of reasoning and explain their types with examples. The next question is human eye has number of limitations. You have to identify any three and explain it with examples for six marks. Next on the topic of human memory they will ask any one question from this three question like discuss short term memory with example or explain significance of sensory memory in interaction design or compare short term memory and long term memory of human with respect to capacity access time and forgetting. So this three question generally asked for six marks. The next question what can system designer do to minimize the memory load of the user for the four marks. The next question on the basis of human emotions like human emotions play important role in designing a GUI for any application. So you need to elaborate how human emotions will be helpful for designing with examples for 6 marks. The next question is explain input output channels in HCI with examples. So here you have to explain 5 input output channels with diagrams and with their examples point wise for 6 marks. Next. The next most important topic is understanding interaction. On this topic multiple questions will be asked. The first question either they will ask describe any 4 interaction style that used to accommodate dialogue between user and computer and mention their advantages and disadvantages for 8 marks or they will ask list different interaction style and explain specific like command line interface or menu interface. So you have to prepare all interaction style either you have to explain specific one or you have to explain all the one right for 8 or 6 marks. The next question most important question like explain following WIMP interface element with respect to any text editor like icon, menu, toolbar and dialog box for 8 marks. The next question is what are the difference between menu bar and toolbar? 
many time user face the problem to understanding the icon between them and how to resolve this issue for six marks so here you have to explain this thing with your own language with examples with diagrams the next question is explain for translation of interaction framework that is articulation performance presentation observation with example here you have to draw the diagram of interaction framework you proper naming convention and after that explain this four translations with example point wise for eight marks next question is explain paradigms of interaction design for six marks and again most important question what is ergonomics list and explain various disciplines of ergonomics here you have to draw the diagram and list and explain all this ergonomics with examples for six marks the next question is that is scenario based question suggest idea for an interface which uses the properties of sound effectively for six marks next the next important topic is sci models and theories on the basis of this topic they will ask explain snyderman's eight golden rules of interface design here you have to prepare all the golden rules proper naming conventions and explain this with examples for six marks next what are the norman seven principles for transforming difficult task to simple one here you have to mention all the norman seven principles with explanation point wise for six marks the next question is what is mean by keystroke level model and how it is different from physical model for eight marks next question what are the mental model and why are they important to interface the design for four marks so here you have to draw the diagram of this model and explain point wise then discuss application meant for computer mediated communication for six marks the next important topic is hta right so here you need to draw hta for any particular application that will they will ask in your exam like hta diagram of telephonic calling system hta diagram of cleaning the house or hta diagram of online bus reservation system you have to prepare specific hta diagram and their explanation for eight marks this is a compulsory question the next one is discuss difference between klm and gms model for eight marks you have to mention any seven to eight points regarding this model the next question is scenario based question like create gms description of the task of prototyping paper from journal discuss the issue closer in terms of gms description for eight marks and last question is you have to explain these two models for eight marks like physical device model linguistic model here you have to draw the diagram plus their explanation the next important point is hci design process on this topic they will ask most important question that is first question what is prototype explain different types of rapid prototyping technique here you have to mention the definition their types with example and with proper point wise explanation for eight marks the next one is explain hill climbing approach of prototyping for eight marks then uh, there is a scenario based question write an interaction scenario of music player design means how music player design will be developed how user use this music player design which types of functionalities there you have to explain this thing in your own language for six marks the next important point is mvc and wire framing so they will ask any one question like what is the need of mvc pattern draw figure and explain it for eight marks or they will ask write a short note on wire framing or mvc for eight marks the next they will ask any one question from this what is design what is the golden rules of design and you need to illustrate the process of interaction design for eight marks or they will ask explain hci design process with nit diagram for eight marks sir you have to explain their definition their golden rules their diagram of hci design process with proper explanation the next this remaining four are the uh, scenario based question like when system are not designed properly to match the way people actually work then how user end up having to do the work so you need to discuss this thing for six marks next scenario based question is create a prototype user interface for digital wrist watch suppose there is a prototype of digital wrist watch so how this prototype will be helpful for user over analog design for six marks and next scenario based question is write a complete scenario on airline reservation tickets so how this particular applications have made and how 
which types of functionalities they will provide. So you have to explain any one scenario with six marks in your own language, point wise, with examples. And last question is what is the definition of usability as per ISO standard? So you have to mention the definition usability and how this definition will be helpful with Microsoft Office products. Means Microsoft Office products how provide the different usability techniques for eight marks. The next topic is HCI guidelines and evaluation technique. On this topic, they will ask the first important question. Describe any four usability goals for Internet Explorer. So generally on this topic, they will ask scenario based question. How Internet Explorer usable uh, for the user for eight marks. The next one is there is a smartphone and cell phone. So how it is different, how it is usable to the user for six marks. Then explain Nelson's 10 heuristic principles for eight marks. This is one of the most important question. Then complete cognitive walkthrough example for the video remote control design for eight marks. This is also most important topic cognitive walkthrough design. You have to prepare this. The next one is explain techniques to choose evaluation method for six marks and describe user interface management system with example for six marks. So here these first four questions are very much important. The last topic is future of HCI. So on the basis of this topic, they will ask any question that is scenario based question like explain the terms augmented reality and virtual reality for eight marks or they will ask specific one like explain augmented reality with real life scenario for six marks or virtual reality for six marks. The next important question is explain the challenges while designing smart homes and smart electronic devices for eight marks and what is the future of HCI with real life example for six marks. So on this topic, they will ask any question on the basis of particular scenario. So you have to understand the scenario and write down the answer point wise with examples in your own language. Next. So hope so. This all questions will be helpful while preparing for your exam. All the best. Thank you.